Well, good afternoon, right? Yeah, 12, 12 o'clock. Ooh, suddenly. <laughs> Why is it? This is, this is, yeah, 12 o'clock afternoon. Afternoon, if you're just joining us, it's great to have your company. If uh, you have been uh, kind of thinking about color and how to apply color and how to color your images, this is the right hour to tune in because we are talking about the one day special alcohol markers, a full spectrum of colors and brilliant quality. And of course, we will have amazing savings as well because it is the one day special. Now, if you are um, thinking about having a full collection of alcohol pens, you are kind of thinking, well, you have to have all those greys, those beautiful yellows, and so, on, so much more. You can go under the website and go for the pick and mix, and there are sets of four pens, and you pick and choose any three. Now, that would cost you around 21 pounds and a few pennies bottoms of the screen so 21 pounds and 97 pence it has got each of those uh, kind of uh, pick a mix you will have a, a pound saving now if you went for all nine of those color options then you will you would have a 72 pound saving eight, eight pounds multiply for those options however if you go for the full, the one day special, not only those 72 pounds are carried forward, but additionally you have got a 10 pound saving. So that would be 82 pounds if you are not a Freedom member. If you are a Freedom member, that saving then increases to over a hundred pounds because of course as a freedom member it's not a 10 pound saving and that you have in the one day special but at, at 28 pounds and 77 pence on top of that you are getting 10 free colorless blending pens and of course you have uh, the as a freedom member uh, you would can flexibly three in through three payments of 56 pounds and 32 pence and then that of course is the delivered cost now that is all the numbers done how However, we want to see what they can do, and there is no better way than to have the amazing John Lowe to explain it all about it. Hello. I, got, I got through it all in two minutes. I don't know what you mean about the amazing, but you know, I'm, well, I'm kind of. What I like about you, and that is something that I have, you know, way before I started working, even before I knew you, I would watch. And of course, that was kind of an incredible way that you break down uh, what, uh, you know, like what we have, you know, how yeah. we crafters want to do it. You need to understand it, don't you? To me, you have to understand why something works. You have to get the best, you have to get the best quality, I think, that you can afford for the job you're doing. That is That's exactly That's the difference. I have struggled with colouring. People know I've been doing stamp shows. I designed my own stamps yep. for years, for sort of six, seven years. I've never been happy with my colouring. I had a one-day course and I was thinking, is it me? Mm. Because we always say a bad workman blames his tools. Yes. And I was blaming my pens. And I've got lots of pens. And the, the one thing I want to extend, express on this is there isn't a pen here from this collection I've got and I've got to say, I have every single one of where these, I have the sets of them, yeah? Every single one I bought, none of them were given to me for being in the industry or, yeah. you know, for, for doing shows yeah. or anything like that. None of them, I've bought all of these, so I've invested that money. And I thought these were not, and it was me. Okay. Yeah, then I was asked to test these and I was actually genuinely looking at buying and investing and starting the journey in Copics. Yeah, which are the best. Yeah, I remember you talked yeah. to, to yeah, about it. Yeah, we talked about it because you told yeah. me the lack of greens yeah. in there. This was genuinely what we were going on. This is a conversation Paula and I had what, mm. six, seven months ago yeah, at least. Yeah, did. Oh, so must have been. Then these came out and I was testing these and what I found is that I can colour. And that is the big difference and it's because I've got the right products. I'm going to put here, this is the very first image that I coloured with these when I got them. It is so gorgeous. this is the very first one I did. And basically I got the charts that comes with it because these all come in colour blend families. So I went, I like, where are we, 218, let's find it, 218, do you know my eyesight is getting far, far worse, there we go. So yeah, I went that one. So that's what I want. I got the colours and I just coloured them and blended it absolutely beautiful. perfectly. And what I discovered was that these are the best that I have used in either the cheap, 
the mid price or the sort of, you know, that upper mid yeah, price that yeah, we go absolutely. to. I won't go to now yeah. the ridiculous price exactly, of £6 yeah. a pen. I don't do enough. I'm a crafter. Yeah. I'm not an artist. Yeah. If you are an artist, I wouldn't knock it and you want to go down that road. But I know I spoke to my friend Leslie, who is a Copic instructor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and she trained on everything and she uses about, I think she said it's about 60 or 70 of her pens. Wow. She's got like the 300 yeah, yeah, or yeah. 500 job. Yeah. She's got all wow. of them. Yeah. And what I found is with this, I've got a beautiful colour intensity. They work, and as you said to me, because you were colouring before the show, because yes, you I couldn't was. stop yourself, you said to me, you were right, these are really good quality. You so now that's done, I love the colours. It, it is, well, for me, what it sells a, any colouring range is the colour. Uh, now, also, I kind of say, well, this is literally in two minutes before, like when we get the mics in, but this is like literally two minutes, the first time that I've really used them. Yes, the, you can see that uh, there is a little bit of bleed. That's because I use the blenders, because one of the reasons I wanted to use the blenders, and I used it a lot more than I would, is because you are getting 10 of them, right? And there is a lot of techniques that we kind of shy away from them. And there's a lot of things you can do with them. So it's great that you get them because, of course, uh, John was showing how you can put a little bit of color into from directly the other, other colors. And, of course, you put it onto the blender. And, of course, then you brand it in together as well. Now, if you want to go for the one day special, over 40% of the stock has gone. Now, if you want to go for it, um, and you have got the details there, 339. 520 and of course remember we the flexi buy as a freedom member is of course 56 pounds and 32 pence you will find them on the website and of course the craftstore.com you will find them alongside of course the alcohol inks as well there they are everything is in there including those uh, scoring boards which I'd rather look the look of that and now of course you have got them in there as well as this stays in place um, pick a mix you have got three different options and you're choosing any two as well as those beautiful full of stamps and you can see the blooming branch with the magnolia and flower those ones are the ones that John was using and of course you have as well the blank ink pads that you can use your stays ink place or the alcohol ink into there to cr oh just had an idea yes you know the blank ones Yes. So because you are going for two alcohol um, ones so for instance the Arctic white and the sparkly black you could do an ombre you could do an ombre with them yeah, you could do that with your pens. Are you going to know the pen pens as well, you could actually yeah? use the pens to load up your alcohol ink. Ooh. So your 10 blenders can actually turn into 10 or 20 new colours for you oh. by pulling alcohol inks you've yeah. existing got all the glitter ones. Wow. I'll have to try that one and see if we can get it to do Maybe. it. Maybe. I'm going to show you something really quickly with the blenders. Yes. Because I love this. And we, we were talking about this. And we were talking about this with Kirsty, our producer, who, to be fair, doesn't know alcohol colouring. No. You know, a lot of us don't. And she heard the word blender and said, does that blend the colours? And yeah. it doesn't. What it does is, if you look how intense this flower is, yeah. yeah? So this has been done using the guide, number one. Okay. Yeah. So that told me what to do and that resulted in that flower. Can, can we stop a, little, a second there? Can we appreciate how gorgeous that red is? It's, how, it, it's you, so stunning. You said to me before the show started, it's really strange, you should be able to have five minutes of the show. Yeah. Before the show, you should yeah. hear us talking before the show. You said to me, you've never seen a collection of pens that has that sort of bright carmine red shading shades Absolutely. in there. Absolutely. And you don't. And I thought I straight know. away it matches your lipstick. Um, well, that's why this is what I use but I, the alcohol. That's <laughs> the finished card with it. Yeah. Oh. That looks really, that to me, I'm really proud of. It's beautiful. And it's been a long time since I've been proud of some of my colouring. Well, but it's so funny. easy. But again, that's on the way to there. But if I want to lighten it, this is where your blender comes in. Yeah. So what I can do is, can you see where these... I know that there'll be light here where it's yeah. lighter. So if I just go with the blender, what it does is it pushes the ink through. So can you see that gradually I'm getting a light reflection on those areas? So yeah. as I go through, can you see it lightening up? And that's why we're talking about blenders. Oh, wow. Yeah, so you can see there, okay? Yeah. So that's where you can go in and start to actually yeah. lighten it up. There we go, you see? Okay. Can you see yeah. the difference between that side and that side? 
by using the blender. But I think the thing that you want to know to me is how do you get that and how the biggest thing I want to learn is how do you choose the colours and that's a lot of the time you go on the courses first. And it really is. You don't need to, because this chart, these colours were all selected based on what blends. Not what's pretty, not having a massive collection, but what blends. So what I've actually done is, I've actually gone for, I think it's this one here. Yeah, because I thought people might get bored of watching me choose them out. So I like that pink blend there. Yeah? So I want to do a pink flower. OK. Really simple, and I'm going to do this so... I'm going to do this massively quick, just to show you. So I'm actually going to use, check my thing, 230 is my first one. And all I'm going to do is go, literally, very quick. You see how I yeah. would use the bullet tip to get into here properly. But I want people to really feel confident about the fact that it's not, it's not that we always blame our tools, but sometimes we've been yeah. right in doing it. And it is the tools that are doing it wrong. So this is really quick and really, so what we'd say, quick and dirty, yeah? Mm. So I'm going in, just going from the middle out, flicking out with, there we go, okay. with the next colour, OK? I'm getting the darkest shade. And I'm doing the same thing again, following the little lines on the stamp almost. OK? okay? That's it, yeah? Really simple, yeah? yeah? Then I'm going to go back to my original colour and I'm going to take this time the and bullet colour, tip yeah. and all I'm going to do is colour out to the edge and just in that really quick doing it, you'll see how those colours start to blend. I'm making this really yeah. messy. But I wanted to be quick for people because I've done a lot of sort of slower ones. But you see... Yeah, so... Suddenly, the colour starts to burst out. Yep. And all I'd do is take the darker pen, take the bullet tip... OK. ..and go around the outside. Yeah. But as it goes for a quick one, and then... Quick achievement. Let's put some more dark in. And the great thing about alcohol markers is that it won't be, uh, it won't um, wrinkle the card. Like, the fibres don't come undone, do they? No, the fibres don't. But we've got a really quick, simple flower done. Really easy. Yes. But I'm going to. I just wanted to show you that you can achieve something very, very quickly, very quickly. and get yeah. that shine. Absolutely. Now, of course, if you want to go for the full collection, not only you're getting the massive saving as a Freedom member, it works out at over a hundred pounds in saving. Plus, it, that, of course, you have the Flexi, which is three interest-free payments. But also, you are getting the ten colourless blending pens, of course, that you can mix them up, and of course, you have that amazing. Uh, uh, storage which I think is great because you can carry it uh, and let me show you and you have you can store it up uh, upright as John does or you can then do like I do when I have them just because I have them on the on shelves uh, I like to see all the colors so then I kind of easily reach them if you want to go for uh, the one day special well I need to tell you as well that it will be this part from the 12th of August uh, because they come in from Australia down under 339520 is your item Number. Just an interesting one on that mm -hmm. one, just because of what happened on the last show, right. is once the one day special is over at six o'clock, yeah. these will come off. Right. So if you are thinking about them, yeah. Um, which is what happened on the last show I did, and I got lots of messages on social media, people saying, where else can I get the pens? Yeah. The answer is nowhere else. Yeah. They are only here. Right. And after six o'clock tonight, they will come off. Right. So you have until six o'clock. It's not a case of the price will go up, but they will actually just come off completely mm -hmm. and they won't be available until the next time Couture yeah, Creations yeah. decide to do a show. Well, that is a very good point. And one more reason to check out your baskets if you want beautiful pens, double ended as well with that vibrant colour. Right, of course, that is a one day special. We Couture Creations make lots more and we have got included in here alcohol inks. Now, this is a glittery alcohol ink, which I have never seen alcohol, glittery ones. And of course, 
these ones are, of course, you can see that you have got four different ones, or actually five different options, and you can see them here. Twelve ninety nine is your price, uh, and of course, you have the gorgeous uh, glitches in here. You can see they're tilting it uh, gently, and uh, look at that. Oh, there it is. There it is. Good job, Mark. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Oh, I love the glitter in I, there. I love the glitter in the, in the alcoholics. I've not seen it before. I'm not saying it's not available. I'm not saying other people haven't. But all I've seen before are metallics, which are quite viscous. I've never seen them with yeah. um, glitter actually in there. And again, you see it, it's individually in each different colour. Yeah. It's not just I've thrown glitter over the top, which is what yeah. I'd suspect if I saw yeah, these samples. Well, look, uh, no, I just think it's just beautiful. Uh, now, of course, you have got five different options, and whichever option you're going to get, far, uh, four of them. So we have, in the first one is the pastels. Uh, there we have got angelic, baby pink, maybe blue and peach. Then we have got seasonal. We have got a gorgeous sunflower, verdant, cardinal and cobalt. Then we are, have, of course, the Tutti Frutti with lilac, apple, fuchsia and topaz. Then we have got mosaic. Uh, then we have, uh, you have, of course, amethyst, pumpkin, khaki and burgundy. And finally, we have the gemstones, which are, of course, plum, burnt sienna, turquoise and cappuccino. Whichever of these options you are going to get. And, of course, uh, it has got glitter. Uh, now, if you are watching from the USA, unfortunately, we are not able to ship them to you uh, but everywhere else um, you know of course you can uh, 440072 is your item number 1299 is your price then we have this one is my favorite actually because uh, this one is the one that has got like kind of the graphite onyx and incandescent so it's the minerals ones we love this one don't you I yeah. adore these I'd really really do these to me are the necessities if you're going to start a collection and you're going if you want to add to your existing range of alcohol inks then the incandescent, the onyx, and is it the graphite are just amazing. And what you've got in there is, of course, you've got the glitter in there, so you've got that beautiful sort of colour and shape and shine and everything. So if I just, I'm just going to put a little bit out yeah, okay. of the incandescent. But can you see it's completely clear? Yeah, I can It's see literally it, yeah. just white. So you're seeing absolutely nothing. But when I move that, you're not. Oh, uh, you can't see it. I knew it was going to happen. Tell you what, let's be really bad and pick up a random colour. Oh, we're colour. getting there. You see now when I mix a colour into the incandescent... Oh, look at that. Yeah. It starts to... Can you see it winks at you? Yeah, it does. Oh, it's a winky ink. Ah, look, oh, look at that. But it's just the most beautiful, look beautiful colours. Love these. Absolutely adore them. Absolutely well, I like that. Gorgeous. I love that finish. I'm going to actually take a print. Oh, and you can pay a two prints. Ooh. And you'll actually double what you get. But this is onto a normal card. This is onto a smooth <gasps> card. Oh, look at that. Now I like that, that is that would want that wants stamping and colouring over. Yeah. Which or, you can do. Or could you could you do with a collider? Could you do foil? You could on foil top? over the top with the collido, yeah. But again, that's the original. Oh my god. Half the stock has gone. I'm forgetting my doing my job. I'm kind of watching them and I'm it like, would look oh, beautiful foiled oh, over uh, the yeah, top. I, in, my, in my head I was just thinking, yeah. I have a stamp that would be amazing. A stamp with a collide on Yeah, I've got one that another one that Leone flogged me the other day mm -hmm. that will work over that, mm -hmm. yes. A three five a seven a one four eight is your item number nine ninety nine is your uh, price for the mineral collection, including oh, a lot of them. Anyway, moving on to alcohol stays in place. Uh, this is an ink pad. It comes with a ring card. It comes blank, and then you of course uh, spread it with the spreader that is included and the alcohol ink uh, ink card in here. Now fifteen pounds and ninety nine pence is for a pick a mix, and there is three different options. You're choosing two options, and there three two one five to five is your item number jet black which has got the glitter mad jet black and then of course we have the final option which is arctic white with a beautiful glittery sparkly thing element 15.99 is your price remember you're choosing any two right uh john uh, i believe you are getting your inks i am out. yeah well I, I thought everyone keeps asking about the sort of um everyone sort of asks about the um 
the onyx black and the incandescent and how you get that sort of granity look. Yeah. And I, this is a different way of doing it and using these and it really takes advantage of the fact that we've got the incandescent in there. Of course. So what I've got in here is this is a spray bottle. Right. And this is alcohol. Right. Except this isn't alcohol blending solution okay. because I'm far too cheap to put that into, into a spray bottle. Right. That's cheap vodka. Okay, I mean, I, I, I you love know, blending if we solution, and I use John, it in the right place. You never see me spraying <laughs> spraying from a water bottle into my mouth. It's not its vodka. Yeah, oh, yeah. But I need some. I just want yeah. something. Water won't yeah. work as well. Okay. What I'm trying to do is just give it. Yeah. You see now. Look how they are flowing yeah. out. Wow. In circles. Right. Yeah. So rather than if I take a dry piece. Okay. And I'll show you on a, a sort of a dry piece. What will happen with that is I need to blow them. Oh, so can you okay. see how those sort of stay sat? Yeah. Whereas by adding that, I start to get the little cells forming and opening up. Okay. So if I now start to add in between. Okay. So yeah. the thing. But what you get is with this, and that's so different, is if, I'm not sure if the camera's picking up, but in the centre of each oh, one, yes, there it is. I've got I've a got the glitter. On that, yeah. yeah. That is what is just so beautiful, yeah? And I've got this big thing. I, I'm t terrible for doing this. Absolutely terrible for doing things like in a stripe going across, right. sort of down the paper. So I'm going to add a few more of the black ones. What I'm going to do now is add a little bit of the incandescent over the top. So this will hopefully start to wink at you. So we're getting almost cells. You see, it's starting to get that look as if it was a sort of a granite. This is more sort of granite than, than the marble. But I can take that and start to now. Draw the lines through. You know that wow. you would get. That's just gorgeous. And I'm going to take the incandescent and follow some of those lines, but it sits on the surface. Do you? I mean, I, this is the sort of thing I would like to sit down and just to just just to spend hours doing. Down. But we so are approaching sixty percent of the mineral. Our sort of living. Almost, and I can't explain to you, I'm getting purple shots off this because yeah. of the incandescent mm -hmm. glitter. I'm getting little fleckles of purple off that, yeah. but you see the glittering? Yeah, we That's can see. as the um, alcohol is evaporating off. Yeah. But you see the difference from actually spraying it first of all. Yeah. But anyone can do that. That looks like one of those cell, you know, the cell pores that you do with yes, the different colours. Yes, absolutely, yeah. It's got that same sort of look as opposed to just flat. And this is onto glossy card. Yeah. So just onto sort of chrome glossy card on its own. So these I would have to blow with a sort of blowing tool, but by adding the alcohol spray first. So get yourself a decent spray bottle. I'm using the old eye zinc ones. Um, yeah. And just literally put it with some cheap alcohol. Nothing. And it will make them flow, but you'll get that. And again, that just needs to dry. Yeah. Trim that down, stamp over it, mm -hmm. just as a background. It just works absolutely yeah. beautifully. Yes, you see, that's amazing. Cool. Do you want to go through something? Yeah, I'm of gonna course, I'm going to give the details. 357148 is your item number. And of course, you are getting the uh, beautiful onyx. You are getting the graphite, and you are getting the incandescent. Uh, that is the mineral option. Of course, 999 is your price. 357148 is your item number. I can see myself just doing backgrounds, the backgrounds and backgrounds as well, with this ones as well. Right, and of course, do check out your baskets uh, because they are very busy for this. It's just 999. Imagine the hours of fun creating backgrounds in there as well. I don't know about you, but I was watching and I was like, mm. I just want to play. I just want to have a go. I mean, I keep showing this one because it's just incredible. It's just beautiful. But then it's how you incorporate it. Just with a stamping image in black in there, you can have it. Uh, it just, it's just the ways that you can bring in those effects in there as well. 
think about bubbles as well. Um, kind of going to have for Christmas. Obviously, this is the color ones, but you can decorate them. Whether they are glass or, and of course, you can. Uh, oh, sorry, kind of moving along. Well, like Christmas. Look at that. Uh, three five seven one four eight is your item number, right? And now uh, we have got, of course, the uh, color options. It's a uh, it's an option. So you are choosing bundles in here. You have got five different options. Whichever option you are going to have four colors. The bag. I mean, the glitter content. The way that it sparkles, iridescence. I mean, do you know those cards that you're thinking? I don't know what they are into, especially if they are men. So what am I going to do? Do a background like this, a big happy birthday, a big congratulations. That's it. You don't need, that's the sort of artistic card. These are kind of abstracts as well that you can do. Look at this. That's this. actually got lights in, I'm afraid. Sorry. Look at that. Because that's actually done onto acetate. Yep. So you can actually see through, even though you've got that incandescent um, look in there of the glitters in that and I've not put any of the incandescent on that that's just the glitters in there wow. you're seeing the light shining through and to me if I received that I'd be like wow that's just I could spend hours just looking at it and seeing things in there Look at that. This is without a light. This is without a light. I love this. Uh, 440072 is your item number. £12.99 is your price uh, for them. Right. And now we have got some updates. Uh, so which one? The pastels. 40% of the stock has gone. Uh, 30 fruity, which is this. Almost. Almost. 60% uh, is, uh, is the, uh, the, uh, the uh, update. The final uh, seasonal, which is this one, which we have got up, uh, up the top, approaching 40%. So these ones are the three most busiest ones. So if you want those ones, make sure that you add them to your baskets and check out your baskets. Right, those ones are the Couture Creation Alcohol Inks, but uh, you have got more demos for us? Yeah, what you? I want to show you, I actually did this on a canvas. Um, and I should have brought it in, unfortunately. My mum claimed it. Oh. And it's now hanging in her hall. So I framed oh, so I'm quite play up proud because it's the only piece of my artwork she's ever framed and put up. Um, but I want to show you a slight difference and then an easier way to do it. Um, so you must remember they've got the glitter in there, but they're not thick and viscous like the oh, metallics yeah. you're used to using. So give them a shake. Right. And what I'm going to do this time, again, I've got a piece of gloss paper. All I want to do is put down little tiny dots. Yeah. And what we're going to do is we're going to try and make a little field of flowers. Okay. So, you've almost, when you're doing it on the gloss paper, you've got to be quite quick. So, can you see that they leak together? So, this is traditionally what you would do. You'd do it on gloss paper. But if you can see what I'm getting here is what's actually happening is they're just merging together because they're drying too slowly. Yeah. So use a piece of smooth card. Right. I've got the um, the Dolly Dimples. Is it the mixed media? Or? No, this is her sm cream, oh, cream smooth yeah. card. Okay. But if we watch this, if you see, the dots keep their size yeah. and stay. So we always think alcohol inks can only be used on UPO paper That's or true. expensive paper. And of course they can't, they can be used on anything. So that was the apple green. It's just a different effect. Yeah, what I get this time is a little host of the dots. Yes. And they will stop, and they will stop sort of spreading. So it's just a case of putting these on. And you've got that same sort of beautiful, attractive colours that you've got in the pens. You've got those almost, I want to call them verdant, even though verdant is one of the colours. So you Look see here, just going to put some little pink dots in. So I'm kind of making almost a little field of flowers. Yeah, it's true. It's like pointy, pointillism. Um, pointillism. Pointillism. Yeah. yeah. See, so, I, 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 another one of I know the words in Spanish, but not in English. What's the word in Spanish? Pointillismo. Pointillismo. Mm -hmm. Ah. Which is oh, very yeah, similar, but you pronounce it. Someone saying to me, if you want to learn Spanish and you want to learn a lot of words in quickly, take anything with. Y on the end, like community, and put dad on it. <laughs> yeah. So community becomes communidad. Yeah, exactly. Velocity yeah. becomes velocidad, yeah, which is yeah. speeding. So, yeah. yeah, there's a lot of them. Pontelismo. Pontelismo. With all, also, one of the other ones is up. So you can see that we've sort of yeah. got a little field of Love flowers. That. 
starting, Love but of course that. you've got the glitter in all of them. Yeah. Love that. And don't worry, I'm using my water medium mat. You want a lot of scratch paper yep. down or the water medium mat because yep. of silicon so that you can clean it and it's not I don't have to worry that you know nobody's Adam's not gonna have to come in and resand this desk after I've finished. Or he would have words with you. He would have words with yeah. me. But one of the ways that we actually mix them together and that you can actually make this look more realistic is just to take the fine point on your black yeah. and decide which ones you think of would look nice as bigger flowers. Yeah. And just put some little centers in them. And you start to see then that they come, mm -hmm. you start to see them as little flowers. Yeah. And we just put them into little dots in to the centers. Now when you do it on a canvas, it doesn't spread as far, but. I love that. I love, love that. And, and my favorite thing to do ever, what makes things yeah. completely, is when you frame it. Oh, look at that. Look at now that. you've got there, to my yeah. mind, there is, I'm going to block that bit out, there's a collection of flowers, hand-painted flowers at the bottom. Yes. Any, you know, any point you want mm -hmm. to go on. Absolutely. You know, anywhere yeah. you want to go. But it's, it's when you actually do the framing. But there is, there is a way to do it on gloss paper. Okay. And a way to get a softer, more subtle yeah, way to do it. Absolutely. Now, normally. Can I give an update? I know if you could, of that'd be great. the minerals. Cut some card. Yeah. Uh, so while well, John gets some card, uh, the minerals very busy for us. Approaching seventy percent of the stock has gone. You remember you were getting the graphite, the onyx, and incandescent. Uh, Three five seven one four eight is your item number. And of course, remember that the stock should last until uh, the four o'clock hour. Will it do that? If you don't want to run the risk, do check out your basket and you will uh, of course get them for sure right right so what I'm gonna do John. now is we put these on the show these are the blank ink pads oh yes that we do with the Kaleido of course so this is the first time we've done them on the own you actually get four of them yeah but these are a high quality airtight ink pad right so of course so you can use them mix them with the alcohol inks to make your own right. alcohol ink ink pads or yeah. make your own sort of almost stamps so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the same colors Okay. So I'm putting wow. the pink on, look at the glisten, and then... Oh! Oh! I love that! But I'm you see so happy! Oh my goodness, that is just... It's stretching out. I love that! So I get that first impression. Yeah? I, okay. I, I've never seen that I've done before. No, I, I, I came it. up, I, I mean, I don't know if anyone's tried it before, I came up with this when I was playing at home yeah. a couple of days ago. And so I'm just going to do the same with the purple randomly. Mm. So if you feel you're not artistic, anyone yeah. can do this. Oh, that, I love that. I love that. You see how they, because we're not putting definite yes. drops down, yeah. they're I not just, starting to go away. And I like that away. it's the full size pad, so therefore you have got like well, a, it's almost creating a I've stamp. I've tried it with it. the blenders, yeah. and it doesn't work yeah. as well, because you don't have that soft pressure. So when I use it with a blender, I'll just do a couple of little ones, because I don't want to. If I try it with a blender, see, it yeah. doesn't, Give me the, the circular pattern, yeah. it just sits there. Yeah. So this is not something to use with your blender, this is to do with your ink blank ink pads. And what I've done is I've got one, because the first thing you would think is, because I know what I would think, is that, yeah, but I've ruined this pad now, haven't I? Because what happens is when this is finished, yeah, and yeah. um, that's ruined. So here's one I did five days ago. Wow. Wow. So it's not, and if I show you, because I'll finish this off in a second. Again, look. It's not, yeah. yeah. It's so a stain, but it's not now dirty, yeah. To make, if I want to, because I'm gonna, I will do a little bit of a background with it in a second. So I've got that almost to get me started. Now, if the last one I put on was some red, so give it a good shake. Make sure I get plenty of the glitter. If you don't shake it, you won't get the glitter. Because it'll sit at the bottom, like it does with anything like that that you have. So let's just now 
but can you see how it builds like a little field of poppies? And then again, I can just do the very. And if you have, for instance, your your um, finger stamps, you could then a stamp on top of it, couldn't you? There is, yeah. If you look on the crafting with John Next Door group, I think Art Angels put them in there. Although I have to say, none of these are Craft Two or John Next Door products, so they aren't a Craft Two issue. Um, just because I don't want people obviously ringing there or asking, you know, we don't know. It is Couture Creations and the craft store yeah. for this. But she did pop in there. She's actually done some with some of the new finger stamps, Lovely. which you shouldn't have seen backgrounds oh, yeah. like this. But again, same idea. But to me, I feel like I've been really artistic for once. Uh, it just looks amazing. Well, you are very artistic. But I know you're so. Uh, when we so frame. Oh, I love that. I love that. It's a water. I buy that. Yeah. I can actually see now where. Once. It's like uh, it does like pattern paper that you have bought some from somewhere, yeah. But you yeah. can do that. I did one of these yeah. years ago without the glitter. Yeah. That um, is beautiful. And it was um, of a large poppy, and a colleague and friend of mine, Sally, mm -hmm. rang me after the show and she went, "That's going in my living room," <laughs> and I had to give it to her. Yeah. I think it's on my Facebook somewhere, but it was on her living room. But you see now. Doesn't that look? That is but strange. anyone can do that because it's literally just mm. using the blank ink pad. They are. So, I knew that these were going to be the best thing ever when we did these blank ink they pads. They are gorgeous. Uh, now, of course, you have got a set of four. The possibilities are gorgeous. The possibilities what you can do with four blank ink pads, and then of course you can then re-ink them as you wish. Uh, there's you can do ombre effects as well. A uh, five eight five one two five is your item number. Nine ninety nine is a price. Nobody has been harmed in the making of this program. Well, the day is young, so uh, anyway, uh, if you want them, put them in your basket and check out your basket approach a quarter of the stock has gone now very busy for them now of course at uh, the inks are very busy as well and we have them in here the mineral inks uh, we have got the graphite the onyx and incandescent and of course those ones you are getting all three of them for 9.99 and yeah the, what appears it, it's gonna come out the right details and of course if you go for this set as I mentioned 9.99 is your price so you can see them there uh, now very busy for those ones so if you want them you know what to do they are absolutely stunning uh, three five seven Seriously, what is? Oopsie, and they were designed specifically so that they stack. They stack, <laughs> but Paula does not know where no. to put the hands on. Where to put the hands? So therefore, they will play. <laughs> I can't I've been told now. <laughs> it's my fault. Absolutely my fault. Uh, 357148. Uh, right, uh, now of course we are talking about uh, scoring boards and here and we have got the, uh, the 12 by 12 uh, in here, so which is the uh, scoring board in here. This is a 12 by 12. Uh, we have got uh, scoring lines at every quarter uh, of an inch, which means that you have got be able to do lots of different scoring elements. Also you have, the, I believe, the bottom was to They're make buckets at every eighth of an inch. Oh, eighth of an inch? Yeah, so it's actually got a oh, scoring yeah. line at every eighth of an inch. And I use an eighth of an inch, you know, for my mats and layers, yeah. it's perfect. Yeah, you get the corner, which gives you all of the instructions that tell you how to actually get the instructions with oh. it. But the corner is, it slots on. Yeah. Basically, whichever way you're using it. And this is how this will make you envelopes. Yeah. So it's full instructions in there, but it actually shows you how to make your envelopes as well. The other thing I love about this, so you, it's all in one. Yeah. There's two things I love about this. The first one is it's accurate. Oh. And I know that sounds weird, but you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When Absolutely. I say it's accurate, the number of times I've had boards that aren't, and this one is. And the second thing is, the actual tool scoring you get yeah. for it is a different plastic than the scoreboard. And what that means is that it doesn't wear down in it. Oh. The number of times, you know when you get, yeah. I've had a scoreboard and you get the same colour yeah. and the same plastic in the tool. And what happens is you lose that sharpness. Yeah. But I've literally got, and grab a piece of card on this. Because it jams in, this reminds me of my first one I got from America yeah. a long time ago. Yeah, me too. So it scrolls in, but I mean, I can go every eighth of an inch, but look wow. how sharp. That is sharp. Oh, you can see that. But can you see there? I don't if think you, you can. If you put your hand there, there it says, yeah, there. 
everything, yeah, yeah. is. But I'll, I'll do some folding on it. But look, I mean, literally, watch, look on there, get that top, get that bottom. That is straight, yeah? yeah. But again, I can just go all the way around and yeah, turn yeah. that corner. I can either like book a spine as well. Kind it's because of it's big. accurate, yeah. I've got a full turned corner. Mm. And that's what I love. And look, they meet up. Yeah? Yeah, perfect. £21.99. I love as well that it kind of has the storage for what the tool and this corner here. Uh, 12 by 12 is this, that's the size £21.99. No extended delivery on that one. Eight, uh, 588584 is your item number. Then we have the 8 by 6, also very uh, portable. And of course, you have got the instructions as well for envelopes in there. And it comes with its own bone folder or a scoring board. Uh, uh, scoring folder yeah so yeah uh, uh, three six nine eight five six seven scoring tool that's the one ten pounds and 49 pence for that and then the watercolor media mud which uh, you know it's funny because john um when you t uh, told us about it and then of course you started using it you said well was the product of 2020 this is my product of 2020 of everything that i designed and developed everything i put out under my own yeah. brand Every John Next Door product, my favourite of all of them is this, because it's so easy to use, but it's saved my life so many times. It's, I know, when we're alcohol colouring, which is yes. one of the reasons I put it on this show, or using alcohol inks, you have either got to get used to two things. One is having a big pile of paper underneath to yes. take the overspill. Yeah. Yeah. And if you don't do that and you get it onto like this primed wood surface, yeah, yeah. it has to be sanded off. Okay. You exactly. do that on your dining table, yep. you've wrecked it. But this is heat resistant, this is alcohol resistant, this is dishwasher safe. Which is incredible. So the best thing ever is, because I've done it before, when you know you buy the heat mats, the, yeah. the brown ones. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Yeah. Get them at all different price scales, I've had all of yeah. them. And they all say, yeah, and you can clean them easily. What you spend most of your time is, is cleaning them and running them under a sink and they flex everywhere. Put them in the dishwasher, even though the heat they'll ruin. Mm -hmm. This one's been through the dishwasher over 30 times. Wow. And it just gets thrown in. But it's got the well. So literally, I'm making all this mess and nothing is anywhere else. Or any marks on this table are from before I got yeah. here. And I love as well the three uh, um, uh, boxes that you have there as yeah. well. The original design that we were shown had lot, like eight, yeah. had sort of like, I think it was like something like 20 little tiny oh. ones. Useless, because mm -hmm. it comes from a soldering mat. Yeah. I, mean, I would hate to say we reinvented yeah. the no. wheel. It's based on a silicon soldering mat, ah. so it also means I could set fire to my alcohol inks on it. Oh, if you wanted to. Because it will take the heat. If you wanted to upside Andy. Yeah, I could put it in the oven. I won't, because I haven't said I'll do it this show. Yeah. Uh, but you can do anything on it. And again, it just rolls up. Yeah. And I know that when... Because I asked you if there was any... Yeah. When you launched your range... Yeah. I asked Paola if there was any Crafts 2 products that she wanted to use or she really felt she needed. And the very first thing on the list was this. Obviously. I Before like anything, anything else, else that we're famous for, yeah. Paola said, I'd really like a media mat, yeah. please. Because obviously I have done shows with you, Anna, but I can say that that is always on my table. Now I have got a, a bigger table now, so I have got a glass mat because I still like it to cut into it. But then of course the watercolour media mat sits on the side, so whenever I have to do any types of inks, any type of colouring. You yeah. know what it's also very good for? I mean, go on. So I like to stamp on parchment or vellum and do a tiny bit of white work. Oh, this would be tiny perfect bit. for it. That works really well. Yes, because of course it, it's silicon, exactly. so it will take so that. Also you, what I do is with pencils, when you colour it, and if you do a little bit more of, of colouring um, parchment on the back, so you're colouring, pressing a little through. bit more, ah. you can get that white. So if you control it, that work a treat. See? It's a yeah, fabulous product. Yeah, <laughs> 19 pounds and 99 pence is your price. It's funny working with John because we're like, yes, and then, and then we go like, oh, exciting. Uh, 785543 is your item number. And of course, we have got the stamps that we, uh, uh, John has been using. Uh, we don't have the physical samples, but uh, they are on the website, of course. Uh, they are the Magnolia and the Branch. They are my favorites. And 999 is your price. 616335 is your item number for those ones. But we also have the 
the other set, which is the fabulous, um, beautiful branch in here, which is that elegant flow. And let me put the sample in here so you can see it. And then, of course, if you go with the two J's, uh, beautiful finger uh, stamps, then you can create a stunning images. Or if you are using the alcohol pens, just to add a little bit of color, 657-265 is your item number, 999 is your price for both of them. Right, John? Next demo. Right, okay, so this is another idea I'd had using the ink pads. Ooh, yeah. We always want lots of different things and new things to do, and certainly when you get the beautiful glitters. But you see how the glitter even stays in the pad? Okay. That's yeah. got no ink in it. Press it down, nothing comes out. That's how stable wow. that is, which is fantastic. So I'm going to do now is kind of reactivate the pad. So I'm giving it a squirt with my alcohol. You can use blending solution or you can use vodka like I'm using. Ooh. Wouldn't use that for everything, yeah. it's just in the for spray it, bottle. Yeah. And what I'm going to do is I want to try and get a little bit of a night time going. Right. Yeah. So I'm going to lay down onyx black. Okay. Yeah. Then I'm going to go with the graphite. And this is the great thing, is because if I use I try and do a blender with this, I get yeah. the shape. Because it's an ink pad, this is cobalt. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with baby blue. So just add the baby blue at the bottom. And I want to make sure this is well activated, so give it another spritz. So I take it off okay. to the box that I've got. Oh. Ideally, if you can drop it on the floor, it always works best. Yeah, I mean, I add a little bit of a sparkle it from always the floor. Does, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So sorry, I've not ruined the desk at all, Adam, but I've ruined your floor. Yeah, again. exactly. But can you see? <gasps> Ooh. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love this so much. So I'm working it down. So there I've got... I mean, look at the cells. I mean, it looks like almost like um, a snake skin. It does, and it's sort of opening out. And again, if I want to darken it at all, just... You see, I'm working yeah. like I would do with an ink pad. Oh. Adding more colour on. Oh. Approaching 40% for the blank ink pads. If you want them, uh, just make sure to check out your ba you, you check out your baskets. You are getting four of them. So imagine to having your own ombre, maybe that the, the, you're going to have like a... a like our John was using, maybe the sky, or maybe you want to use in different colours. It's up to you. There's so many techniques with uh, with these uh, these blanking there, pads. There is. I mean, when these first came back, when these first came back into stock, yeah. um, I actually ordered myself eight of them. <laughs> Well, I'm not surprised. Uh, because I thought there's so many things I can use. Yeah. These. What about my other reinkers? What about my ink sprays? Yeah. The things that I don't use because they're too messy. Can I control it more? So if you see now, this is starting to dry. Yeah. But that looks like I've done a watercolour, expensive, difficult yeah. technique, and I don't do difficult techniques. So now I'm going to take the angelic. Okay, yeah. Now the angelic, I think, is in the pastels. This is where, whereas the incandescent is clear, the angelic is, is white. Is white. Oh. So, I I'm see. going to add... There we go. So I thought we'll add some stars, shall we? OK, yeah. So. Oh. Oh. Or snow. Or snow. Look, they look proper snowflakes. It is. It's snow, isn't it? It is. I or so uh, you know, so focus. Uh, it's the bokeh. bokeh. Oh, look at that! And look at the tech. Good shot, Marcus. Like that shot. Oh, oh look well at that! Well done. Look at that. Look at the look. incandescent shine that I'm going to get from that. Look at that. So I've got that beautiful, just using this. And this is something people would think you've spent hours over. So if I want to add yeah. a little bit of, um, if I sort of almost want to add some little stars, I'll just go on with the incandescent in a few places. Yeah. And you can see those starting to sparkle away. That is so just You've got gorgeous. your stars, you can start to add other colours in. But you've got the most perfect background yeah but of course what we've also got is so I'm going to move that to one side 
Right. Do you just want to go through something a second? Yeah, of like course, I will give the details the of the alcohol inks, especially the minerals, the graphite, the onyx, and of course, the incandescents. Now, £9.99 £9 is the price for all three of them. 357148 is your item and number. Uh, they are actually, you know, and also, they are, let's be honest, just when you need something that is kind of a neutral background, this is kind of the perfect thing. Think about all your Christmas images. If you have got silhouettes into the woods, maybe you have got the cardio, maybe you have got the, those beautiful kind of silhouettes of fairies as well on the touch tools, and you want something kind of perfectly for Christmas, but then you can have the image in there with the background. This is perfect. Over 70% of the stock has gone. If you want yours, do check out your baskets. Back to you, but John. Of course, so this is the one I made earlier for the flowers. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to use whatever's left just to make myself a random background that, again, because it's gloss card, yeah. so that's <gasps> dry. Oh, I love that. Yeah. I can just... Mm almost go from a dark to light can't yeah. I as it starts to dry on the pad so you've got this makes me think of 1980s like draw wrapper paper it is yeah <laughs> it's that sort of look like the tutti fruity type thing so there I've made a background on my gloss card so already I've got a beautiful gloss soft pastel finish oh, and again you can that. see you're still getting that glitter shine in there it is but what I'm going to do now is we could bring in my Press to impress, and I'm going to take. I love this stamp. Oh, I, it's I, I, so I don't beautiful. know what it is. It's so evocative. It this is. is what it really is. And I can see it even working for Christmas, like putting a little tiny instead of the flowers. If you put die-cut flowers, which I wonder if there is some Christmas Christmas flowers coming up anytime soon. I don't soon. know what you could do with some really like mm, mini poinsettias, exactly. couldn't you? To go and I was on thinking, that. Just you know, perhaps a, a plate that would do you sort of twenty poinsettias all now from like ten talking. millimeters down. Yeah. Something, Something like, like that. that would be fantastic. Exactly. If only a crafter can think of dye. Like they come all in one place, so for Christmas you can do all of them yeah. in one go. Yeah, if only. But you see, what I've actually Eighth done of, now of August. is... 8th of August, one day special. I oh, think yes! 8th mm. of August. Yeah, that sounds, that sounds vaguely familiar. It does. So I'm just going to reactivate this and make a little bit more on it. So I'm going back with those colours I was using, the graphite yeah. and the cobalt. Yeah. And you see how dark this pad, this is the pad I used to make the night sky. Doesn't matter, it's not like yeah. a blending, okay. with a, it's not like the blending felts okay. that you have that will go hard or will ruin, you have to keep replacing yeah. them, because I have boxes of them, because I go through so yeah, many. You do, do, yeah. Now I don't, I tend don't to use these more, but a lot better value. Now I'm making my own sparkle ink pad. Oh, look at that. And if I bring this one up so you can, yeah. you can see it, I go, I'll hold it to camera one and you can probably see there a little bit better. Yeah, you can see there, 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 there it is. There it is. It's, yeah, that that's a sparkle. Beautiful, sparkling. I mean, I can see the sparkles. So we are about, I would say, two and a half to three meters apart aside from each other from uh, the minute. And I can see the you sparkle see from the here. You can see the sparkle. Yeah. I mean, it's not. It's not in your face. I'm not thinking that it's a fa you know kind of the sort of really glittery. Is that kind of glistening? Is it a basically the the frost in the morning, the winter morning? That sort of glitter. And of course, the closer you get, the more the more the light reflects. I think that they're very sophisticated, very beautiful. But also, if you want to go for the stamps details on the screen, 9.99 is the price for those glorious blossoms. Uh, the, the, of course, the branch and the blooming as well. Now, uh, we have got, of course, the minerals are one of the stars of the shows. The graphite, the onyx, and the incandescent. Uh, you have got 12 mil in each of them, those ones. And, of course, you have the, uh, those three colors that blend beautifully, creating that kind of neutral colors, those blacks or grays. Approaching 80% of the stock has gone. If you want yours, do check out your baskets. I love that they have got glitter in it, but they are alcohol ink, so you will have the ability to do it, on obviously, over glossy surface but like John has shown don't be shy of testing them in on gloss or non glossy surfaces for a different effect uh, 357148 is your item number then of course we have the alcohol inks in the color options we have got five options 
four colors in each, uh, starting with the pastels in here. Then we have, of course, the seasonal, uh, also very busy for the seasonal. Then we have got the Tutti Frutti, which I'm making, I'm, I'm going so fast, Marcus is like, uh, this is a Tutti Frutti lilac apple fuchsia and topaz. Then we have got the mosaic as well, with the khakis, amethyst, pumpkin, and burgundy. And finally, we have got the gemstones with plum, burnt sienna, turquoise, and cappuccino. Now, Tutti Frutti is on the link, so if you wanted that one, do check out your basket. Twelve ninety nine is your price. Four four zero zero seven two is your item number. Now you have brought uh, a score. Of course, uh, John has brought the one day special, which is those beautiful alcohol markers. A hundred and eight uh, in total. Now. If we break it down, if you were to buy them individual in, in individually, uh, you would actually be paying for individual pens a hundred pounds. If you are not a Freedom member, a hundred pounds more. Why? Because. First of all, we offer you the pens as a set of four, and you're choosing three of those sets. So therefore, and you have a eight pound saving. If you chose to go for the full collection in the pink and mix, you would have a 72 pound saving because we are giving you them in sets of uh, three of those uh, sets. Then, additionally, not only we are th we are putting 10 blender pens, we are giving you the case and giving you a 10 pound saving. However, if you are a Freedom member, that 10, sa 10 pounds saving becomes 28 pounds 77 pence, which when you consider 72 pounds, it means that it's over 100 pounds saving. On top of that, of course, is as a Freedom member, you don't pay PMP, so you are saving there as well. And if you're thinking, yeah, it still is this a considered purchase to make it one of payment, we're giving you the, the ability to flexi buy, to spread the cost into three interest free payments of. Sorry, I just cannot see yeah, how it is. 56 pounds and 32 pence. The cable was just right on the L. Anyway, so it's like very, very kind of nice uh, position there, the cable, but the red look. Anyway, 339520 is your item number. And of course, you can see them there. Remember to check out your baskets for that phenomenal price. And also, it's not only about the price, it's of course the vibrancy of the colors, the way that the two nibs work so well. Another thing that I love about them, they don't roll off the table because they kind of they have got that tri tri uh, triangle design. The other thing I love about them is that you have, and this is very important, do you have, of course, the numbers either end? So if whatever way you put it, you know which one it is. Because not alcohol makers, uh, not alcohol ma markers have that ability or and that they're design. they're all named as well. Which There's a colour name on each yeah. one, so if you want to remember names, remember names. The names, And absolutely. all in English, which makes a difference. <laughs> it does indeed. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 339520 is your item number for the one day special. John, a pleasure as always. Thank we'll see you, you soon. See you soon. And then, if not, stay tuned here at the Crafts.